short barreled shotgun, uh, the definition is very similar to a short barreled rifle. Uh, the barrel length is two inches different. To be a short barreled shotgun, uh, barrel length has to be 14 inches or less. 18, 18, 18 inches. inches. I'm sorry, wrong direction. 18 inches. So a regular old shotgun has to have at least an 18 inch barrel. Less than that, it's going to be a short barreled shotgun. The overall length is the same, 26 inches. Anyway, you can see this uh, looks pretty short. I thought short barrel shotguns were illegal in Indiana. And Indiana, you're right, they are. They are. Um, that being said, a dealer or a manufacturer can have them regardless of where they are. Well, and then the other one is that they're papered as an AOW when they're manufactured. Yeah, that's the true. Same exact gun, depending on how it was paper went. That's true. Made. And that's why these two things kind of go together. One of the beauties of the BATF, the logic of government. This <laughs> is an 870 with a seven and a half inch barrel. That last gun I held up was an 870 with a 14 inch barrel. That's a short barreled shotgun. This isn't any other weapon. Why? Because that has a stock on it. This has a pistol grip and has never had a stock on it. Wow. Now, if you take the stock off of that gun and put it on here, it becomes a short barreled shotgun, which is not legal in Indiana. Unless you're a dealer. Unless you're a dealer. To be transferred to any old person. Now, is that a forever and a day proposition? What do you mean? If you put a stock on it once, now if you put a stock on it, you have instantly committed a felony. And you'll go and have a roommate named Bubba for the next 10 years. And it stays that way. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just the addition of the stock is a felony in and of itself. And it can never go back to being an AOW after having had a stock on it. Correct. Yeah, that, that was that was correct. Yeah, well, that, that's correct. Once, once a short barrel shotgun, always a short barrel shotgun. Yeah. Same with machine guns. Right. Unless you change them into a legal configuration and have them taken right. off of it. Now, the other side of that is on that 870, for example, take the stock off and put a pistol grip on still a short barrel shotgun because it at one time had a stock on it. It can never be an AOW. Um, some places, this, this gun right here is mine. It was made by a company called Safety Harbor out of Florida. Um, they can, if you buy a, a let's say a, a Mossberg 500 Cruiser, the pistol grip only shotgun, you can send that to a place like Safety Harbor or Cerebu and they'll cut the barrel down and they will transfer it back to you as an AOW because it never had a stock on it. It started life as a pistol grip only shotgun which we kind of digress out of the NFA world, in Indiana is a handgun, it is not a shotgun. Because by definition, a stock shotgun has to be shoulder fired, which means it has to have a stock on it. So in Indiana, if you go to the gun shop, you buy a 500 Cruiser, regardless of barrel length, they're gonna to have to transfer it on the 4473 as a handgun. So they have 